What is going on everyone? I am Nuxpro and in this video I'm going to show you how to complete Gunsmith Part 5 where we have to modify a DVL-10 and turn it into mechanic. This one's pretty straightforward, so let's get right into it. Up on the screen right now are all the attachments you're going to need in order for mechanic to accept this weapon. There will be a parts list in the description as well if you want to copy and paste into the wiki or whatever. And there is an alternate build that I'll talk about in the video that will also be in the description below. Now, the first thing we're going to need is a DVL-10. Now, there's a bunch of different ways we can get this. The best way, I think, to do this as early as possible is to do the skier barter trade for the DVL-10. The only issue is it is skier level three and you need to be level 28 to get skier level three. So that'll be your minimum. Uh, the trade is pretty simple. It is five horses and one teapot. That is only going to cost you horses are 20 K right now. So 20 times five is two, four, six, eight, ten. 10. That's a hundred thousand. 130,000 rubles to get a DVL from Skier. Now, if you're not level 28, you can buy it off the flea market. Unfortunately, very expensive right now, 259,000 rubles. Now you're probably seeing on the screen, oh, how do I get that DVL from Skier for 80,000 rubles? Well, that's locked behind a quest and the quest is from Skier. It is long road where you got to kill 15 scavs on the long main road, which is hit or miss on how hard it is. A lighthouse can, is a wacky place, but if you get this done, you can buy it for 80 K. Now, once you have your standard DVL, you're going to leave everything on it, except the magazine. You could take that out and uh, sell that and get a little money back for your, for your DVL purchase. Now, no matter what, you need a blue tactical laser on it. That blue tactical laser is available level one skier. Uh, right there. Pretty famous in the other gunsmiths as well, if you've been following along with my other guides. Now, all you need now is a mount and a scope. Now, there's two different combinations you can do for this. So the first one is this. This is the Smith, Schmidt and Bender PM2. And then you got the uh, Rucknagel Aerotech 34 millimeter ring scope mount. This will cost you, we'll just call that 70 and 80. We'll call that 87,000. Now there is a second option you can do. It is more expensive as of now. Prices could change. We're still, I don't know, two weeks into the wipe or so. So this combination, you're going to need the night force scope, which is currently going for, we'll just call that 80. And then you need the mount for that. It's the IEA and I'll have all this in the description. Uh, Mill optics, 34 millimeter, and that's 26. So 80, that's 106 K. So the tan combo is going to be cheaper. Now let's assemble. We already have our blue laser on there. Mount scope. Let's turn it in. No magazine. It can't be folded. So make sure it's unfolded. Part five is done. So thank you for watching the video. I hope that helped. Don't forget to leave a like for the YouTube algorithm. It helps so much. Takes one second of your day. And don't forget to subscribe. We have a bunch of other Tarkov quest guides on the channel. I'll see you in the next video.